the XY plane, Cartesian plane. Instead of columns and rows, there are two number lines OX and OY which meet at right angles at O, which is the origin. Coordinates are points or positions and are written in the form X, Y. Examples 2015. Illustrate the solution of X plus Y less or equal to negative 2 on the X or Y plane shown below by shading the wanted region for the domain negative 5 less or equal to x less or equal to to 1. So when you are given a question like that one, the values of x are known as the domain and the values of y are known as the range. So what you are supposed to do is to make y the subject of the formula and then start replacing the values of x in the equation to find the values of y which are the range. So what you are going to do is to say x plus y less or equal to negative 2 will make y the subject of the formula where there's less or equal to replace it with equals. So we are going to say y is equal to negative 2 minus x. When you transpose this x and take it to the right hand side, the sign has to, to change. It will become a, a negative x. So what we are going to do is to draw a table of content or a table of values. We'll start when x is negative 5, where this x replace a negative 5. When you have a minus and a negative, it is the same as a plus. So it's the same as negative 2 plus 5, which will give us a positive 3. When x is negative 4, y will be equal to negative 2 plus 4, which will give us a positive 2. When x is equal to negative 3, you say negative 2 minus negative 3 is the same as negative 2 plus 3, which will give us a positive 1. When x is negative 2, we are going to have negative 2 plus 2, which will give us a 0. When x is negative 1, we are going to have negative 2 plus 1, which will give us a negative 1. When x is 0, negative 2 minus negative 0 or negative 2 plus 0 give us a negative 2. When we have x is equal to 1, it's the same as negative 2 minus 1, which is going to give us a negative 3. So from here, what you're supposed to do is to put them in the form x, y. So our first coordinate will be negative 5, 3. Then we have negative 4, 2, negative 3, 1, negative 2, 0, negative 1, negative 1, 0, negative 2, 1, negative 3. So our coordinates will look like that. From here, what you're supposed to do is to plot those coordinates on the x or y plane. So our x or y plane will look like that. Our horizontal line is called the x-axis and our vertical line is called the y-axis. So our first coordinate is negative 5, comma, positive 3. Negative 5 is on the x-axis and 3 is on the y-axis where they intersect there. That is our point negative 5, comma, 3. Our point negative 4, comma, 2 we have our x as our negative 4 and our y is a positive 2. It will be somewhere there. Then we have negative 3, comma, positive 1 will be somewhere here. And then we have negative 2, comma, 0 will be on the x-axis itself. Then we have negative 1, comma, negative 1, which will be somewhere there. Then we have 0, comma, negative 2, which will be on the y-axis itself at negative 2. Then we have 1, comma, negative 3, which will be somewhere there. So when you plot those points, join them. It will look like that. Now the question is saying, illustrate the solution x plus y less or equal to negative 2 on the x or y plane shown below by shading the wanted region. So to find the wanted region, you can pick any point either on the upper part of the line or below the line. Pick any point, substitute it into the 
in equation to prove whether it's going to give you a true sentence. So I can pick the point 0, 0, which is there at the origin. If I substitute here, where there's x, I put a 0. Where there's y, I replace a 0. 0 plus 0 is giving us a 0. Is 0 less than negative 2? No. If it's giving you a statement which is not true, then shed the other region. It means that this region is the one which will be true for the inequality. Let's try to pick a point negative 3, comma negative 3 or negative 3, comma negative 2 and replace. Negative 3 plus negative 2 will give us a negative 5. Is negative 5 less than negative 2? Yes. So this shaded region makes it true. So that is how you solve that inequality. We go to the next question. 2016. On the grid provided below, plot the points V, negative 5, comma, negative 5, W is negative 5, comma, 1, X is negative 2, comma, 3, Y is 1, comma, 1, and Z is 1, comma, negative 5. Join the points to form a polygon V, W, X, Y, Z. Draw the line X equal to negative 2. So we'll take it step by step. We'll draw our X or Y plane or our Cartesian plane. It will look like that. Our point negative 5 comma negative 5 will be here where you have our, your X coordinate negative 5, Y negative 5 where they are intersecting will be there. And then we have the point negative 5 comma positive 1 will be somewhere there. Then we have the point negative 2 comma positive 3 will be somewhere here. And then we have the point 1 comma 1 which will be there. And 1 comma negative 5 will be somewhere there. So it's going to look like that. Our V is the point negative 5 comma negative 5 which is there. Our W is negative 5 comma positive 1 which will be there. Our X is the point negative 2 comma 3 which is there. Our point Y is the point 1 comma 1. And our point Z is the point 1 comma negative 5. So the question is saying join the points to form a polygon. So we'll join them and it will look like that. Then part 3 is saying draw the line x equal to negative 2. So if you want to draw the line or you have to draw the line x equal to negative 2, it's the same as having negative 2 comma y. The negative 2 has to be the x coordinate. So this is the point negative 2 comma 0. This is the point negative 2 comma 1, negative 2 comma 2 negative 2 comma 3 negative 2 comma 4 negative 2 comma negative 1 negative 2 comma negative 2 negative 2 comma negative 3 negative 2 comma negative 4 negative 2 comma negative 5 so our x equal to negative 2 will be that line 2018 illustrate the solution of y less or equal to x plus 4 on the x or y plane shown below by shading the wanted region for the domain negative 4 less or equal to x less or equal to 2, 3. So the values of x are known as the domain and the values of y are known as the range. So you are going to put your table of contents according to the domain they want you to, to look at. So from here we are going to say where there's less or equal to, we will substitute the equal sign. You say y equals to x plus 4. Put your table of values or table of content. Then we'll be substituting the values of x in the equation to find the range, which are the values of y. We'll start. When x is negative 4, negative 4 plus 4 will give us a 0. y is 0. When x is negative 3, negative 3 plus 4 will give us a positive 1. When x is negative 2, negative 2 plus 4 will give us a positive 2. When x is negative 1, negative 1 plus 4 will give us a positive 3. When x is 0, 0 plus 4 will give us a positive 4. 
when x is 1, we have 1 plus 4, which is giving us a 5. When x is 2, 2 plus 4 is giving us 6. When x is 3, 3 plus 4 is giving us a 7. So we'll put this in the form x, comma y. Our coordinates will be negative 4, comma 0, negative 3, comma 1, negative 2, comma 2, negative 1, comma 3, 0, comma 4, 1, comma 5, 2, comma 6, and 3, comma 7 like that from there what you are supposed to do is to plot them on the x or y plane so our x or y plane is that one negative 4 comma 0 is on the x-axis itself it will be here then we have negative 3 comma 1 negative 2 comma 2 will be there then we have negative 1 comma 3 will be there 0 comma 4 will be on the y axis itself then we have 1 comma 5 which is there 2 comma 6 which is there and 3 comma 7 which is there so our graph will look like that now the question is saying illustrate the solution by shading the wanted region so to find the wanted region we can always pick any point maybe i can pick the point 1 comma 2 if you pick the point 1 comma 2 replace it in the inequality our inequality is y less or equal to x plus 4 if you pick the point 1 comma 2 where there's y replace a 2 less or equal to where there's x replace a 1 plus 4 so if you add 1 plus 4 you get a 5 2 is less than 5 so the point 1 comma 2 is on the side which is below the line so this is the region which will make the inequality true if you pick any point where it's shaded here and replace it into that inequality it's going to give a true sentence 2018 question 80 on the x or y plane plot the points on the x or y plane below, plot the points L, negative 4, comma 3, M is 4, comma 1, and N is 1, comma, negative 3. Draw the graph of Y is equal to negative 3. So this is straightforward. We'll draw our x or y plane or the Cartesian plane. Put your x axis, which is horizontal. Put your y axis, which is vertical. Coordinates are always given in the form x comma y so our negative 4 is there on the x-axis and our positive 3 is there so our l will be at the point negative 4 comma 3 which is there then we have 4 comma 1 4 comma 1 is that point there we'll call that m then we have the point 1 comma negative 3 will be somewhere there which will be our n so when you plot them we have our negative 4 comma 3 which is there we have our 4 comma 1 which is there our m and then we have our 1 comma negative 3 which is our n then join them draw the graph of y is equal to negative 3 y is equal to negative 3 is the coordinate x comma negative 3 all the y coordinates must be negative 3 this is the point 0 comma negative 3 this is the point 1 comma negative 3 2 comma negative 3 3 comma negative 3 4 comma negative 3 we have negative 1 comma negative 3 negative 2 comma negative 3 negative 3 comma negative 3 and negative 4 comma negative 3 so when you join those points it's going to give us that line so that is the graph y is equal to negative 3. As simple as that.